morning guys welcome to another video and welcome to our very first video on our new camera actually let me let me show you guys what it looks like we got a new baby it is the Canon 6D Mark II and it is absolutely beautiful I'm trying to get a side view of the camera oh. babe look at that it's so big bigger's better right <laughs> <laughs> I'm really excited, one, because mainly because the autofocus is amazing, so I know a lot of you guys have commented on my other vlogs with our other camera, the autofocus sucked, my face was never in focus, so I'm really excited to vlog. But today, this morning, we are up quite early, we're having some melon for breakfast, just a light breakfast, I'm not super hungry this morning, and we're gonna do something exciting this morning. I think they call these Santa Claus melons. No, but Santa Cruz. <laughs> Santa Claus? I don't know. Let me know. What do you guys call them in the comments down below? I think they're like different. Sugar melons. Everyone oh. is saying they call them sugar melons. Mm. We're having some sugar melons. Sugar melons. This is my first time actually vlogging with this camera, like holding it first person. And it's actually less heavy than I thought it was going to be, but it's a lot more wide than our last camera. Like I can fit to the ends of my fingertips. <coughs> Bless you. Sorry. So, like I said, we are going to be doing something very exciting today, this morning. We are going with our Airbnb host. Again, if you watched my last video, we went on a little adventure. Um, he has a car, so it makes things a lot easier because it is kind of far away. I've been wanting to do this since we got here to South Africa. It's kind of like a must-see thing when you come here. A lot of you guys might know what I'm talking about, but I think I should just show you. Resident price? Non-resident Thank you. Price. Well guys, we've uh, come to what they call Boulders Beach and the drive here was absolutely beautiful and this beach is full of penguins and they've migrated from Antarctica here to Africa so now they keep this as kind of like a little sanctuary and they keep a little breeding ground for penguins and we're gonna get to go see them and I'm so excited so it looks like you gotta climb over these rocks I'm scared just jump no I'm scared oh, oh hi little guy just, just don't drop this because I don't know how we're gonna get home. <laughs> I just made it there. Oh, you're so cute. First penguin of the day so far. Never seen a penguin in real life, so this is pretty cool. Ah, uh. oh. girl. <laughs> Listening to their little footsteps, like. We just want to hang out, guys. Where are you going? What? Oh my god. It's me and you. It's me and you in penguin form. Look at them sleeping together. That's literally the cutest thing I've ever seen. spot Maddie in here? Oh, there she is. Oh, that was gross. Oh. This is like the best day ever. I've never seen a penguin in real life and then being able to be this close to them is just like surreal. And their natural habitat too, which is just crazy. 
Yes, these are my new best friends. I have migrated here. I have found my calling. This is my family. I match them too. They're so cute. That guy's my lover over there. I was trying to kiss him and he was getting real close to me. Yeah, he was. Well, thanks guys for uh, letting me hang out with you. It's been real. See you guys again soon. This was the best day ever. Honestly, like, they're really cool animals. I never realized how cool penguins were until today. But look at them, and they're so chill. Except for when they go like this. That scares me. And then <laughs> yeah. when they're like, what are you doing? <laughs>
with some fruit and nut granola that's actually oil free. There's like sunflower seeds and almonds and dried fruits like raisins and stuff like that in there. And then I topped it off with a golden kiwi and a regular kiwi. And I'm gonna put a little bit of almond milk on that and that's gonna be my lunch for today. I also had a shower but then we decided that we were gonna go to the gym, so I don't know if that really defeated my purpose of the shower, but I felt really gross after being in the sand at that beach, I don't know why. But I'm going to eat, I've already edited a video, I have a little bit of work to do. You penguin poop. I probably sat in penguin poop, <laughs> probably, but it was worth it, it was so worth it. That was such an awesome morning, like, well, that was amazing. We'll flash a picture of it right here. Of the penguin poop? Yeah, penguin poop, right? No, a picture of you with the penguins right here. Oh, yeah. We got some awesome photos, so go check out my Instagram. I'm going to eat my little oatmeal bowl, digest a little bit, do some more work, and then we're going to go to the gym. I'm using the 35 millimeter lens, so I'm like having to hold my hand out a lot further. That's why you're a little zoomed in compared to the beginning. But let me know in the comments down below how you guys are liking this camera. I'm loving this camera. Kyle's loving this camera. Especially for photos, but this Especially is my autofocus. in autofocus. But this is the first like actual vlog that I'm filming on this, so I don't really know how it's going. So let me know in the comments down below how you like it. All right, guys, we are back from the gym. It's been probably an hour since we worked out. I had a protein shake, and now I'm very excited. I am making some tacos for dinner. I know I made tacos. Did I make tacos in my last video? No. It was my video. It was your video. That's why I'm getting confused. I made these like curried cauliflower tacos on the Kyle and Maddie vlog channel a few they days out ago. Amazing. Yeah, it was like Kyle's like new favorite thing and they turned out so well. Insert clip here. It's good, eh? Wow. I'm a genius. A lot of people requested on that video that I make it on this channel and kind of share with you guys how I make it. So I'm going to share with you guys kind of like how I'm doing it. It's like I always like how I always cook. I just kind of winged it and I didn't really measure anything. So now I'm going to try to like measure it out and give you guys more of a specific recipe so you guys can make it at home. But that's what I'm about to do right now. Curried cauliflower tacos get in my belly. Kyle's just doing some uh, stretching. Zoom. Oh. What do y'all think of Ariana Grande's new song? I think it all sounds the same. I think it's completely different from anything <laughs> that she's ever put out. <laughs> Maybe it's just her voice sounds the same, which makes sense. Because she is the same person. <laughs> okay, time to make tacos. <laughs> two cloves of garlic and an, about an inch piece of ginger peeled, minced very finely. And then also I'm using about half an onion. I didn't use onion the last time because we didn't have onion, but I definitely think onion will make it taste a lot better. So we've got that ready to go. And now I have cauliflower. So I just have like this one small head of cauliflower and you're gonna cut it up into kind of small pieces. So you don't wanna leave them in like huge Florets, Flor flores, I don't know what you call them. It's kind of like pieces that big. And then I'm just gonna put it all into a bowl. All right, so I have a pan with just a little bit of water and first thing that's going in is some onion. Cumin. We'll say about half a teaspoon and also some paprika, probably about a teaspoon. <laughs> and then we're just going to saute those for a little bit just to kind of cook them down a bit with the spices. And while that's going, I am going to make some quinoa, but I'm going to make some coconut quinoa using some coconut milk just to kind of add the creaminess because I'm not adding coconut milk to this cauliflower curry. So I have 
half a cup of coconut milk from a can and about a cup of water and then I have a cup of quinoa and I'm gonna cook that while this is cooking. Next in goes the garlic and the ginger and our curry paste. I'm using Masaman curry but I think red curry would actually be a little bit better in this recipe but this is the only vegan curry paste that we have. And I'm adding probably two tablespoons, one and a half tablespoons to two tablespoons of curry paste but add as much as you want to make it as spicy as you want. I'm just going to use up the rest of this packet. Mmm, it smells so good. And now all of that is combined. I am going to add in some of this tomato puree. I don't remember exactly how much I added in the last time. So we're just going to see as we go. So you want enough of this to be able to coat the amount of cauliflower that you have. So we're going to wait for that to get nice and hot and then we're going to add in our cauliflower and just let that kind of simmer on a medium to low heat until the cauliflower is cooked through and then we just assemble the tacos. What a success. Tacos for everybody. This, these are Kyle's tacos that <laughs> I plated. <laughs> didn't make them look as pretty and we didn't have it. We don't have any more lettuce. So I use the lettuce to make a little pretty display for you guys. So I hope you appreciate that. But yeah, we're going to enjoy these tacos. I made five tacos for us each. I'll be full after that for sure. Kyle will probably want some more, but there ain't no more. So. Sorry, honey. <laughs> Boo. This sauce that I put on was just tahini mixed with a little bit of lime juice and some water just to kind of add a little bit of lime and creaminess to it because I feel like that's what was missing the last time. And then topped it with avocado, cherry tomatoes, and yeah, it's amazing. And if you guys want the recipe, I will link uh, the full recipe in the description on my blog. So make sure you go and check it out. Let's have some water. Cheers, my gears. Cheers. Cheers to a good day, you know? Today was an amazing day. I love those penguins, they're amazing. <sighs> Such a great day. <sighs> Did you like pour it all in your mouth? <laughs> Drink your water. Everyone's gonna be like, I already know how they taste from Kyle's vlog. Well, not everybody just watches that. There's some people that only watch my channel, so. They're getting the first-hand experience here. I'm so happy you made some tacos. <laughs> yeah. All right, guys. Well, I hope you enjoyed today's video. Again, if you want the recipe, it's linked in the description. You should try it out because it's super quick and easy and delicious. It's Kyle's new favorite. It meal. is my new favorite. And he never really has a favorite, so that says something. It's like um, buffalo cauliflower wings and tacos. That's what it's like. But it's like curry. Yeah. And like tomato. Instead of like hot sauce. If you enjoyed this video, please make sure to hit the like button as it helps to support my channel. Leave me a comment down below. Subscribe if you're new here and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. Bye. <laughs> <laughs>